This is someone getting Botox injected into their forehead. Let me explain how it can turn wrinkles from this to this in just under two weeks. So we all have nerve cells under our skin that release chemicals to contract our facial muscles. And that's how we make facial expressions. But if those muscles contract too much over time, then that causes wrinkles. So when Botox is injected, it works by blocking those chemical signals to the muscles, reducing contractions, and this causes our facial muscles to relax. And then depending on which area the Botox is injected into, it prevents the formation of wrinkles. The effect of Botox is temporary and usually lasts around three to four months. And that's because the damaged nerve cells eventually regrow and start to resend out those chemicals to reactivate the muscles again. Potential side effects of Botox include pain, swelling, bruising, as well as headaches and flu-like symptoms. And injections into the face can also cause a temporary drooping of the eyelids. The aesthetics industry is hugely underregulated, so if you are thinking of getting Botox, then make sure you stay safe and go to a licensed, trained health professional with extensive experience of the facial anatomy. If you experience any of the side effects I've mentioned, then make sure you contact your doctor immediately and follow for more medical explainers like these.